ヒダナモテロオテロナハワシャオカオガドドレドウベドドロドリボオルバルドオドモノノオドボラハラボオバラガワチャアウゼドウルフジウノハマオンドロホロオバガワガハシャコラボドロビアンジョホワラハツラトラポホシタトメチャケナトゥハバアンドリビンジュジャハシタ I read this story about、uh, <clears throat> I read this story about President Harry S. Truman. It's Harry, right? Was it Henry? I think it's Harry. President Truman, anyhow. Before he was president of the United States, he was president of a university. And in this university,、uh, one of his staff came to him one day and said, You have to tell the students to stop walking on the grass. Between these two particular buildings. So, President Truman, then president of the university, said to this staff of his, Why are the students walking on the grass? And the, staff, the staffer replied, It's the shortest distance between the two buildings. And so, Truman said to the staffer, Pave over the path. You're not going to stop the students from walking on it. <coughs> herein again, <coughs> herein again is、uh, some wisdom akin to. The wisdom that Christ said to Paul the Apostle It is hard for you to kick against the goats, goats being cattle prods. You use cattle prods to get cattle moving, so they are sharp and they are tough. And、uh, it's very hard to kick against them. Again, it's not impossible to kick against cattle prods, but you would do yourself. A lot of damage and、uh, probably no damage to the cattle prods. So it's hard to kick against the, the cattle prods. And the point is, there's no need to kick against the cattle prods. In the case of the students walking on the grass, there is no need to stop them from walking on the grass. Just pave over. The grass where the students have been walking. Because these clever university students have, through collective wisdom, shown you the quickest route between the two buildings. So pave it over. This is similar to an experiment where they did a.、Um, <clears throat> They created the location of subway stations. I'm not sure if this is in Japan or in the UK. They, on, on a giant petri dish, they put the nutrients、uh, according to the location of the subway stations of that city, 
whether it was London or Tokyo, I can't recall offhand, but it doesn't matter. They put the nutrients according to the locations of the subway stations and then allowed the bacteria to grow naturally on the petri dish. And what they found was that the bacteria would then show the most efficient routes from station to station. And based on the growth of the bacteria, you could then create your subway station map, the optimal subway station map. <clears throat> what is the lesson here? You could go against nature and try and enforce your will upon nature. Or you could watch and see what wisdom nature has to show to you. And then follow that wisdom. And you would appear to be a very clever person. <laughs> So yeah, there are times when you need to put your foot down, so to speak, and draw a line in the sand, etc., uh, etc. Et but for the most part, nature provides the path. You just have to open your eyes and look for it and follow it. So that's the story of this little incident with President Truman. <laughs>